What is going on everybody? Welcome to this new video here at Top Notch Programmer. Today I'm back with a new video where I'm showing you how to send messages automatically on Snapchat. So I know I haven't been uploading uh, videos for a while here on this channel, but now I'm back with this new video and hopefully you are going to like it. So let's get started. Okay, so the first thing you have to do is just to go to the description of this video and in the link, you're gonna find the link of this blog here that I wrote in my website. And here you're gonna find everything you you need to set up this bot. Okay, so let's get started. So you know we can't run Snapchat in our computer directly so we are going to use an emulator or an Android emulator because Snapchat doesn't have a website version of the app. And to run an emulator you can install any emulator you want but I prefer to use Bluestack. So just go to the first tab here and install the Bluestacks by clicking this link here. You can click on view all versions and here you can choose any version you want. This is Bluestacks 5 and Bluestacks 4. I pre I recommend recommend you to install Bluestacks 4 because it's more stable. You can go ahead and choose any 32-bit uh, or 64-bit for Windows or Mac. So after downloading it, I have already downloaded here and I have it uh, on my computer. So I'm just going to open it up. After downloading and installing it successfully, you just have to install the Snapchat app in your emulator. So just go to my games and here you have Google Play Store and here you have to make sure you are logged in with your Google account and just go ahead and search for Snapchat and install it directly from here. I have already installed so if I go to home and here you can see I have the Snapchat app. So just go ahead and open it up and here you have to log in your Snapchat account and I am already logged in on the account. So I just going to leave it like this. Actually, I will go to chats and I will leave it like this here. Okay, now, so let's set up the bot for the Snapchat. Go back to the blog or the documentation in the link here. And now we have to install and download uh, the bot from the, my github repository you can find the github repository in this link so just click on github repository and you are going to be redirected on this page here you have to download it to download it just click on code and click on download as zip but but i'm going to use git clone by copying this link to use git clone first you have to download git so just go to google and search for git download and you can download it from there then I will go to my desktop because I want to save it here and I will open my uh, command line or CMD from start menu. Just open it up and now we, I will go to desktop by using this command CD desktop and press enter. Now we are on desktop and I will clone the project here. So just write git clone and paste the link. Press enter and now it's cloning the project. As you can see, we have a new folder here and this is the Snapchat of bot folder. And uh, we got everything we need inside this folder. So now the second thing is to install the requirements for this bot. So let's go inside the folder of this bot by using this command, cd snapchat message bot, press enter. And if I type dir, we have all the files inside it and we need to install this requirements.txt file and to install it we use pip so just write pip install dash r requirements.txt and we just have to press enter if you face a problem like uh, pip is not recognized make sure you have python installed so just go to google and install python but if you don't uh, if you still see this problem make sure to install the python from microsoft store because this is going to fix your problem very quick but this problem happens when you uh, don't have your pip uh, added to the path to the path of the common prop so you can also search for, for google how to add python to path and this will help you so now let's press enter and install these requirements now we have we got them installed okay now all we're gonna do is just to run the bot and to run it just type python bot.py and press enter then it is going to ask you uh, what message do you want to send in the chats here you have to write your message that you want to send in the chats and for example for now just for testing purpose I will type hey 
uh, how are you and I will press enter now it's going to ask you how many chats you want to send a message here you have to put the number uh, of how many people you want to chat and for now we'll type just uh, 10 and press enter now it is showing you now open snapchat in your emulator and place the mouse in one of the chats and press enter now as we are here we are just going to uh, move our mouse and put in the chats here on uh, snapchat so i will scroll down down a little bit in my chats and for example i want to start the bot on this account so i will place the mouse right here and i will just press enter in the comment prompt so press enter now it's going to start the bot okay let's see what is going to happen it will go to the first chat will we'll, uh, send the message and now it is going to scroll down and go to the second one and send a message again so this is how this bot works it scrolls down send the message go back and repeat the same process okay i will wait until i finish 10 uh, messages and i will be back in a second Okay guys, now as you saw, we sent 10 messages to different people here on chats and all of this thing was automatically and now the bot has stopped. So you can put how many messages you want to send and what message uh, you want to send, what you prefer and this is how the bot works. If you face any problem during the bot setup, you just can go to my uh, blog here and you can read it step by step how to run it and all the commands we have here. So this was the bot for today. I hope you like it. Please make sure to like this video, subscribe to the channel and see you in the next videos. Peace.